Engaging India at Al Madalin Week is a marquee event for uh, future urbanisms uh, at the Uppsala University and Zero City. Now, uh, what is uh, the potential that you see for a collaborative approach when it comes to collaborative research, uh, institutions coming together, uh, and collaboration at a government and uh, corporate stakeholdership level for? creating cleaner economies and uh, restoring an ecological balance? I think uh, there is no other way forward but collaboration. And uh, we are really talking about issues which affect us all, um, the, the future of our next generation, so to say. Uh, so no longer people can work in silos, whether they are universities or, or government agencies or industries, because cooperation from everybody is required to, to make progress. So while the government agencies can uh, lay down the guidelines, facilitate interaction, um, enable an environment in which business can be done, similarly the fundamental research and, and breakthroughs in technology come from uh, universities and the private players are the ones uh, who, who can uh, use that to scale up the interventions. So these uh, collaborations are uh, what is the need of the hour. And uh, this is increasingly happening uh, both in uh, India and Sweden and between our uh, countries. Um, if we look at uh, uh, Sweden, uh, there is of course the triple helix model which is very well known and there is very, very seamless uh, cooperation between all these various stakeholders. And increasingly in India also you will find that, um, especially in the last year and a half, you see uh, universities coming up with uh, quick breakthroughs and solutions uh, which are then, uh, let's say, the investors are there to take it, the process forward and the government is also very, very keenly encouraging either by way of seed money for these uh, uh, researches, research projects and so on. And uh, between India and Sweden, as I mentioned, the, there are any number of uh, joint industrial R&D collaborative projects mm. which are going ahead at uh, for many, many important areas, smart cities, smart grids, uh, uh, clean technology in water, e-mobility. So uh, this collaboration is, is obviously needed and it is uh, increasingly growing.